Hello, Wastelanders. It is I, Big Papa Jay, coming at you live from inside of the Batcave. Yes, I'm playing Batman. If this is your first time joining in, if you are a repeat customer, then you already know that. Okay, let's see. Um, do I have anything I want to drop off? I don't remember if I dropped everything off yet. So let's do an R. Um, I got one more magazine I can drop off here. Okay, perfect. I don't think I have any bobbleheads though to drop off. I'm put, I think I'm, I'm almost positive all my bobbleheads have been turned in. Yeah, no bobbleheads, but I did have that one. Uh, one magazine. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. That's the newest one right there. Surgical Journal. Oh, righty. Okay, now. When we left off, we had finished with Kellogg. We went and got the Corsair chip. So I need to make the molecular level, which means I have to make contact with either the Railroad, the Minutemen, or the Brotherhood of Steel to get help in building this thing so i haven't done anything with the minutemen yet and i do want i do have to make contact with the brotherhood of steel and i do have to make contact with the railroad that those are necessities listen to nick valentine detective agency radio let's listen to that real quick um setting this to repeat This is Ellie Perkins from Valentine's Detective Agency with a message for Nick's partner. We've got a new case and it sounds urgent. Stop by the office. I'll be waiting. That would be me. I'm Nick's partner. Stop by the office. I'll be waiting. So let's, let's go ahead and jump in and see what Ellie has to say real quick. Now, I know this is vanilla, but this is what opens the door for us to eventually... To go to Far Far Harbor, and I do want to go to Far Harbor because, unlike some YouTubers, I don't mind doing vanilla. Vanilla is part of the quest line. It's all mingled in together. Depravity, uh, Phoenix City Rising. No, not Phoenix. Fusion, not Phoenix. What I say? What did I say, um, Phoenix? Fusion City Rising. Got him. Got him, got him, got him. So, um, Outcast and Reminence, uh, Project Valkyrie, they're all tied in together. And they all intercross and mingle with Vanilla. One of my favorite YouTubers, and you did hear me say that correct, one of my favorite YouTubers that I like to watch despises doing vanilla. And that is the only pet team I have with him. I love his content. I watch him, listen to him all the time. I'm one of his subscribers. Every time he drops a new video, I watch it. But one of my pet teams is the fact that for some unforgod reason, he despises doing vanilla. Vanilla is part of the game. Get over it, dude. I love your content, but get over it. Vanilla is part of the game. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. We got a new case while you and Nick were out. Ready to put on the detective hat? Uh, tell me more, Ellie. First, who's our client? Who's our client? A fisherman whose family lives on the edge of the Commonwealth, Kenji Nakano. Mr. Nakano didn't leave many details, said he'd go over everything when you meet him. But if you want my guess, missing person case. Guy had a worried look a mile long. Anything you can tell me about? Anything you can tell me about Kenji Nakano? Just some impressions. He was obviously upset, but he was also in a hurry, like he couldn't stand just waiting around. I'm a friend of Nick's. He'll remember me. I need his help right away. And then he was gone. He was muttering something on the way out, but... No. 
I'm not sure it was important. Uh, come on, Ellie. Come on, Ellie. Don't hold out on me. What did he say? Well, I thought I heard him say something about a daughter and also a radio, but I might have misheard him. Not sure how the two would be connected. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I like this one. So, is the fedora and trench coat mandatory when solving these cases? Because I'm thinking smoking pipe and British accent. Hey, whatever floats your boat, gumshoe. The Nakano residence is up in the northeast, near the coast. A small fishing house. He said that he and his wife will be waiting for you. Oh, why did... Nick didn't like that. Did you get offended, Nikki? Did you get offended? Nick, time to hit the road? No, 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 no. Not now. Not now. Well, I'll be around if you change your mind. If I decide to do this case, I'm bringing you with me because you are... I, 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 yeah, yeah, I know. I'm not going to the Nakano residence. Not right now. Because <clears throat> it's all part of Vanilla, so I do want to take Nick with me when I go. I'm eating. What is it? You're always eating, you skimpy little whatever you want to call yourself. Okay, so. Um... Let's go back to data. Far from home. We're not going to do that. Not going to do that. Invitation. I got to go to the bunker. But before I can go to the bunker, I have to do... Um, yeah. I do have to go to the bunker. I have to go to the bunker before I can start um, American Rising. American Rising is rude awakening down here. So there's so much stuff I have to do. Before I can, I, I would like to start like a good neighbor. I and this is um, the minute man, which I don't want to deal with right now. That's Stella. Road to Freedom is the railroad. You know what? I think I'm gonna activate fire support. I think I'm gonna activate fire support. And what I'm gonna actually do is see if I can just jump into it. See if I can just jump into fire support. Um. Let me see, data, activate, listen to, military frequency, okay, let's turn that one on. Proceed to the Cambridge Police Station. Okay, data, um, R, perfect, fast travel. Perfect. That will work. Real fast travel into the police station. Because I got to hook up with the Brotherhood of Steel. I got to get that ball rolling. I'm not going to do any of the radiation, radiant quest, not radiation, any of the radiant quest for the um, Brotherhood of Steel. Because I don't really necessarily have to. I just have to make the initial contact with them. Once I make the initial contact, then we can go from there. Doesn't mean we can go to hell. You tell him. You tell him, buddy. Hold up. I think we're being stalked. Found you. I don't see anybody. I don't see anybody else. Found them. Where? Where are they?
Where are they? You say you found them, but I don't see them. Are they bloody up on top? Not gonna bloody. Not gonna bloody get up there. Hey. Right there, civilian. No unauthorized personnel are permitted beyond this point. I was told you can help me. I need to build a signal interceptor to get into the Institute. That's not going to happen. Unless you're one of us, you're not setting foot inside this base. However, if you're here to sign up, I might have some work you could assist us with. Then we can discuss whatever you like. What kind of work are we talking about? Until I'm certain of your intentions, I'm not willing to discuss that right now. Sure, I'll sign up. Outstanding. I just need you to answer a few questions first. We appreciate the assistance, civilian. But what's your business here? Really? In that case, let me ask you a few questions. Are you from a local settlement? I'm from Vault 111. You're a vault dweller? Most people wouldn't admit to such a thing. I appreciate your honesty. If I appear suspicious, it's because our mission here has been difficult. Since the moment we arrived in the Commonwealth, we've been constantly under fire. If you want to continue pitching in, we could use an extra gun on our side. I'll continue to help, but you owe me an explanation first. Very well. I'm Paladin Dance, Brotherhood of Steel. Over there is Scribe Halen and Knight Reese. I've been trying to send a distress call to our vessel at Boston International Airport. But the signal's too weak to reach them. Sir, if I may... Proceed, Aylin. I've modified the radio tower on the roof of the police station. But I'm afraid it just isn't enough. What we need is something that will boost the signal. Our target is ArcJet Systems, and it contains the technology we need. The Deep Range Transmitter. We infiltrate the facility, secure the transmitter, and bring it back here. So what do you say? You willing to lend the Brotherhood of Steel a hand? Yes. No time to waste. No time to waste. Let's get moving. Outstanding. Halen, take Reese inside and bind his wounds. Yes, sir. Reese, once you're on your feet, I want you to make certain the perimeter is secure. I'm on it. All right, civilian. It's time to prove your worth. Head into the police station and resupply yourself. Then let me know when you're ready to begin. Let's move out, people. All right, big guy. Let's go. Okay. Ooh, that's a legendary zombie. That's a dead legendary zombie. Okay, so let's go in here and resupply. And then me and Pound and Dance are going to make our way down. And I need to go ahead and knock this crest out. Once I get this crest knocked out, then my next objective is to go find the railroad and get on their good graces. Because I got to be on the good graces of... The railroad and holotape. Scribe Helen's personal log. Oh, look at that letter. I need to be on the good graces for the railroad and patch me up or what? The Brotherhood of Steel, both. The prognosis looks pretty grim. Might be more humane to just take you out back and shoot you. <laughs> You're all hard, Doc. Just quit squirming so I can get these bandages on. Don't care about that. I don't care much about that. I like it like that. <laughs> oh, nothing of value up in this joint, though. I was really hoping to find a magazine or something of value. Find a lot of caps. And I hear... I hear a zombie... Dead zombie. I don't know what he was doing up in here. That was a pale head. What was a pale head doing up in here? Well, he's a dead pale head now. He's a dead pale head now. I don't know how he made his way up into the joint, but I took him down. I put him down. I put him down. Put... Nothing. Uh... Okay. 
More bottle caps. More bottle caps. More bottle caps. Uh huh. Stock up on all the bottle cap. Okay, I think let's make a sweep through here real quick. I think I want to jump up in there. I do think I want to jump up in there and see if there's something up in there. Let's see. Do this door here? Okay. Let's stock up on everything I can get my hands on. Stock up on ooh more of another stem pack. You can keep the bloody jet. You can keep that bloody jet. Big Papa don't care for the jet. You can keep it. Um the buff out, you can keep uh, you can keep all that other junk. You can keep on that other junk. Oh buddy. I think I think we are ready to move out. Okay, where you at, Mr. Paladin Dance? I'm all stocked. Let's go. Paladin Dance. You ready to move out? You betcha. I'm ready. Ready? Outstanding. Follow me and try not to lag behind. Take this alley. Follow me. We'll do, Mr. Powden. Guess I'll turn on my light too. Our jet is a short hike to the west. If we take this road, we should be able to avoid the larger packs of ferals infesting Cambridge. Traveling this far from the police station is a risk. But getting that transmitter up and running needs to be our top priority. If it was up, I heard something. The Commonwealth will never be safe with these idiots running around. Outstanding. Look at all these scabbers. That left some good loot laying around. Another one? Now that's just... Okay, lead on, Mr. Powden. Tango down. No problem. I've got this. Target disengaged. So, how was your guys' day? Leave a comment. Tell me, was it a good day, a bad day, an oof day, one of them terrible days? My day was good. Today was the first day of school. Um, at the time of recording this, this is April 1st. So I'm recording this on April 1st. You, you guys won't see it till later in the week, but it's being recorded April 1st. It might surprise you to learn that my recon team isn't the first to visit the Commonwealth. Over the last seven years, you, you hear that? I hear a helicopter going overhead. Can you hear it? I don't know if you can hear it, but there's a helicopter going over my head. A pretty massive helicopter too. I often wonder if that's the military's helicopters because they're pretty they're pretty massive pretty big who the bloody hell shooting at me watch it they've gone dark come on do 
You said it gone dark? It didn't help him. It didn't help him. Boy, the zombies are like killer out here today. Godless heathens? Is that what you said? Tell me how you really feel, Mr. Powden. Why don't you just tell us how you really feel about them? There's an awful lot of bloody gunners out here. Gunners, zombies? This has been one hell of a trek trying to get up here to this joint. We may have a problem. Intruder alert! Now we got bugs! I heard something. Intruder alert! Wow. If it isn't bugs, it's zombies. If it isn't zombies, it's the gunners. Everybody's out to get us. Whoa, whoa. What is that? A dog? You hear that? Yes, Mr. Powden, I hear it. Bloody dogs. Tons of dogs out here, Mr. Powell and Dance. Tons of dogs out here. Are we getting close to this joint? We've been saying like we've been running around for for bloody ever. Not getting past me. Heads up. They've stealthed. The abomination. The bloody zombie. How does a zombie have stealth? I think you're losing your bloody mind, Mr. Powell and Dance. <laughs> you're losing your bloody mind. I don't think we're alone. We got company. Did we get them? There it is. Arc jet systems. There shouldn't be any exterior security. So we'll head in through the front. Don't mind me. I'm just tossing the joint real quick. Make sure there ain't nothing up in here. You know, don't want to... Leave something just laying around that I could use. Listen, oh. we do this clean and quiet. No heroics and buy the book. Understood? This isn't my first rodeo. I understand that. I'm simply offering valuable tactical advice. You'd do well to listen. Remember, our primary target is the deep range transmitter. Stay focused and check your fire. I don't want to be hit by stray bullets. I'm Batman. Hey, we are going in. Corporations like this that put the last nail in the coffin for mankind. They exploited technology for their own gains, possibly cash, ignoring the damage they've done. Ooh, 
Nuka Quantum. Okay. Look wow. Up, Rex. It appears as though the facility's automated security has already been dealt with. Is this the Brotherhood of Steel's handiwork? Unfortunately, no. Look at the evidence. There isn't a single spent ammunition casing or drop of blood in sight. These robots were assaulted by Institute since. I'll be on the lookout. Roger that. Let's move out. Unfortunately, I can't loot none of them. This is a crying shame because I would really like to. But I still see a few pieces of salvage that the Brotherhood might be interested in. After we're done here, I'll have to mark this place for some retrieve. Looks like a dead end. See if you can find a way to get that door open. I'm gonna reconnoiter the area. I hope I have the um, skill set to open that door. I don't know if I do. It's advanced. I should. I should have the skill set. Yes, I do. Okay, security door control. Perfect. I didn't know if I had the skill set to open it or not. Is someone present? By order of the institute, you must be verified. No gun, soldier. Hold up. Movement detected. Curious. An enemy. Look at here, my target has disappeared in place. not gonna waste my time reading but I am gonna loot all the everything I can get out of it okay That was a good, that was a good loot, a good haul. Damn synths have compromised most of the facility. If you say so, Mr. Powder and Dance, if you say so. Remain vigilant, we've got turrets ahead. Ooh, I have a magazine. Excellent. I'll pick that up. I'll be glad to pick that up. Hostiles reacquired. Down. You got anything under control over there? To Good. You keep doing what you're doing. I'm going to keep looking for loot. <laughs> you good there, Paladin? Yeah, I think you're good. Oh, why do you? What did he do? Did he go down? Did he go down? I think he did. I think he went down. Okay, down we go. Then 
of value. Nothing of value. See, I always skip this place because I'm always trying my best to stay on um, Pattern Dance's hind tails. So I always end up skipping it. I never, I know there's, there's got to be stuff that I, I could loot. Magazines or who knows what all that I just missed because, like I said, I'm always staying right behind him and he goes through this place very fast. So I'm actually taking my time today to actually to actually loot and see what I can see what I can come up with. Look at this place. Describes it a field day in here. I'm a looking I'm a looking Mr. Dance. I can turn out my light. Better should be in the control room at the top of the core. But it looks like the elevators are dead. We'll have to keep heading down for now and find a way to get the facility's power back online. There has to be a power backup system somewhere. Scout the maintenance area off the main chamber. I'll remain here and watch our backs. Okay. Got the main chamber. Means I have to turn my bloody light back on again. Another hollow tape. I need to sit down and look at these hollow tapes and see if there's anything of importance. Ooh, a stealth boy. Not that I need it. But see if there's anything of importance on them. Got it. Okay, proceed to the control. Restored. Thermal engine fueled, primed, and standing by for your command. Gone. Command accepted. Commencing five second countdown. Five. I'm gonna fly him alive. <laughs> I am. I'm fixing to fly you alive. I got a front row seat with popcorn. Engine firing. Fascinating. <laughs> Barbecue. Completed. Barbecue. Efficiency rating of 96.7%. That was cool. Oh my god. Are you all right? Got cooked by those flames. But thanks to my power armor, I'm still in one piece. The important thing is that we're still alive. We have a way to get to the transmitter. Let's go. <laughs> I wonder who hit the button. Hmm. It must have been that guy. <laughs> if Powder and Dance only knew the scheming that I'm doing, I plan on killing them all. Taking out the Minutemen, the Institute, the Railroad, the Brotherhood of Steel. I'm gonna take them all out. If he only knew. And then re reactivate the enclave. Hello? Hello. No shit, Dick Tracy. Where did you park your squad car? I hope that's the last of them. Damn it. I don't see the device anywhere. Fan out and check the synth remains. They may have been after the transmitter as well. Yes, they were. Yes, they were. Let's see if I can find it. Um, I think it may be this guy right. If 
right here. Let's get at it. We'll take the service elevator to the service. Alrighty, Mr. Power and Dance. Here we go. Let's take the service elevator. Did I not take it? I thought I took it. I guess not. I'm just standing there like a dingleberry. Just standing there. Hey. Bunker looks. You hear that? Not getting past me. Paladin dance. Well, that could have gone smoother, but mission accomplished. What the hell are you talking about? I thought we did just fine. Smoother? I thought we did fine. We're both alive, and the transmitter's been secured. There's no need to scrutinize the details. I thought we worked well as a team. Agreed. It's a refreshing change to work with a civilian who can follow orders properly. That being said, I believe we have two important matters to discuss. First and foremost, if you'll hand me the deep range transmitter, I'd like to compensate you for your assistance during this operation. I think you'll find this weapon useful. It's my own personal modification of the standard Brotherhood laser rifle. May it serve you well in battle. Okay. That isn't necessary. I insist you keep it. The Brotherhood believes in paying all of its debts. Now, as far as the second matter goes, I wanted to make you a proposal. We had a lot thrown at us back there. Our op could have ended in disaster, but you kept your cool and handled it like a soldier. There's no doubt in my mind that you've got what it takes. When we met at the police station, you told me you wanted to join the Brotherhood of Steel. Is that something you're still willing to do? Or should we just say our goodbyes? No, I'd be honored. I'd be honored to join. That's what I wanted to hear. Meet me back at the police station, and we'll discuss the details. Because I need to get in with you guys so I can continue my journey. Okay, so... Um, return to the police station. We will go knock that out super quick. In the end... I'm going to make my way either back over to Fallon's department store or I might go ahead and try to get hooked up with the railroad. I'm kind of leaning towards Fallon's department store. I might kind of make my way back over there. But I don't know. I still have to do Good Neighbor too. I got so much stuff on my palate. I got so much stuff to do that it ain't, ain't, it ain't even funny. Let's go ahead and get... Let's go... I'm going to put away my gun. I can go in and put away my gun. I don't need it out. Alan and Dance. Glad to see you alive and well, sir. Are we in luck, sir? Mission accomplished. We have the transmitter. Finally, some good news for a change. Nice work, sir. I didn't do it alone. Aylin, Reese, it's time to welcome our newest recruit to the Brotherhood. He shows a lot of promise, and with the proper guidance, I think he has the potential of becoming one of the best. Thanks. I promise not to let you down. You don't have to prove anything else to me. Getting that transmitter was enough. So you decided to stay, huh? I expected you to take your payment and run. Let's just hug this out and get it over with. What do you say? You can play it however you want. <laughs> more than completing one mission to impress me. Reese, that's enough. Like it or not, you're going to have to learn to work together. And you, you need to understand what it means to be a part of the Brotherhood. We're not soldiers of fortune. We're an army. And we've dedicated our lives to uphold a strict code of ethics. If you intend to stay within our ranks, you need to obey our tenets without question. Are you going to teach me this code of ethics? If you are paying attention in Arcjet, you should have learned some of it already. The rest will become apparent as you spend time with your fellow soldiers. Now, 
Since I know you're eager to get started, I'll get right to the point. I only ask for two things from anyone under my command. Honesty and respect. You fall in line, you stay in line. I give you an order and you follow it. It's as simple as that. There's one last order of business I wanted to get out of the way. I'm going to recommend you to be awarded the rank of knight. Now, nothing's official until you speak to Elder Maxon, but I wanted you to be the first to know. Fair enough. Fair enough. Outstanding, soldier. Ad victorium, knight. He doesn't even know what that means, Halen. Ad victorium means to victory. In our eyes, defeat is unacceptable because we're fighting for the future of mankind. Our rallying cry is more powerful than any weapon you could ever carry. Remember that. Now, I've received orders that we're both to report to the Pridwin. However, if you want to run a few ops for Scribe Halen or Knight Reese first, they could certainly use your assistance. I'll leave the choice up to you. Let me know when you're ready to mount up. Okay, so the, I'm gonna leave it sitting here as far as this goes. Um, I'm not going to do the Radiant Chris, but I will be following Pound and Dance to the Pidrin because I need to go there. But the, like I said, there's a few other things I want to, cannot fast travel in this location. There's a few other things I want to do first before we do that. I still got to hook up with the railroad. I still have to, um... Hook up with good neighbor and what have you. So I still have things to case of ammo holding this site. Suppose that means we missed all the fun. No one's gonna move on this place now that the Prid was in town. Okay, map. Um let's go home. Can I do that while enemies are in the area? Who do I bloody have that's an enemy? Turn this off. I don't see no bloody enemies. There ain't nobody here. What the bloody you talking about, you crazy fool? There ain't no bloody buddy here. Crazy fool. Okay, here we go. Off to my office. Hi, Miss Piper. Uh... I don't want to read. I want to transfer. Let's go ahead and get rid of the one magazine that I picked up. I only picked up the one. But it is something to add to my collection. Awesome. Okay, this is Big Papa J. And I'm Batman, Dark Avenger. And we are at the conclusion of another week. Week two. Down. And in the books, when we return on Monday, I'm going to decide on where I want to go next. I'm leaning towards good neighbor, but anything could happen. I've got two days to think about it. This is Big Papa J. Hoping you have a good day or night, depending on what it is where you are. I'm out of here.